It's just free ride, bro, and it goes off tomorrow, and you're gonna see a good show. So stay in tune and keep it locked. With only a few more days remaining here before the third stop of the Freeride World Tour here in Odino, Akali Sandora, let's take a closer look at the standings. Marion Arti from France is continuing her dominance in the snowboard women's field, and in her current form, it's difficult to see who can challenge her. But Michaela Davis Meehan from Australia and Claudia Avon from Canada, who just received a season wildcard, may be able to do just that. In the snowboard men's field, the favourite and the current leader in the ranking is Victor de la Rue from France. But there is plenty of depth and surprises in the snowboard men's category, like Jonathan Penfield popping up and taking the win in kicking horse from the glamour boys like Elias Elhard, Gigi Ruf and Sammy Lopke. Our current leader in the ski women's ranking, Ariana Tricomi, may not be informed to defend her championship title after announcing that she injured her ligament. Hot on her heels is Jessica Hodder from New Zealand as well as Hedvig Vessel out of Norway who both have a win to their name and will be looking to improve their score here in Ordino Akalis. The ski men field, the tightest race of all, the championship title is completely up for grabs. Currently in first place, Andrew Pollard from the US, Rookie of the Year 2019 and third place finisher here in Andorra. Carl Renier from Sweden and tied in first place, Christopher Tadell and Drew Tabke, who both have a win to their names and they're gonna be hungry to improve their scores here. But let us not forget the young Kiwis, Hank Billis, Blake Marshall and Craig Murray in fourth, fifth and sixth place. And then in eighth place, Reina Barkadid, the veteran lurking in the shadows and maybe just waiting to stab those young ones in the back to take the win. Okay, now it's time to go to the face check and speak to some of the athletes. I had super fun here last year, so I'm excited to be here again and ski this face. Uh, a lot of options, so we'll see what we find. Looks exciting. <laughs> <laughs> the venue is a fun venue. It's still a little spicy. Yeah, pretty excited for tomorrow. A lot of good landmarks on this face, so that's that's pretty nice. Yeah. Do some smaller drops with higher speed if it's really firm, and some bigger ones with lower speed if it's better snow. It's getting spicy. <laughs> The face check is good. There is a lot of hard snow in the face, but as you can see, it's snowing right now, so hopefully that smooths everything out a little bit. On attend la neige cette nuit, ce qui pourrait améliorer les landings et les take-offs. Ce serait un scénario similaire à l'année passée où finalement on avait eu des bonnes conditions. It's just free ride, bro. Mother Nature sports and this and that. If you plan something way ahead, expect it to snow. It's like the dew tour or some shit. You know, it always happens. So. She says no. She'll yeah. change her plan. Yeah. You, Mother you Nature always it. has a different plan, but we always <laughs> love Mother Nature and we respect her. So hopefully she just does her thing. And it goes off tomorrow and you're going to see a good show. So stay in tune and keep it locked. <laughs>